And with that, hello, everybody, and welcome to Monarchs Pregame Live here from Sioux City. Dan Vaughn with you here in the press box at Mercy Field at Lewis and Clark Park. Glad you're along. Uh, just a couple minutes here, going to uh, a couple of notes, and uh, really not a lot of notes, but your lineup card tonight, and just give you an update of what uh, situation is. But, uh, the guys arrived uh, late Sunday, had the off day here yesterday, and really uh, just uh, kind of uh, kicking it uh, would be the would be the would be the word of the day. Kicking it, taking it easy, getting a chance to uh, uh, to have the off day here, and the guys uh, uh, hit today. Very warm here. That's probably the first thing. It's uh, it was ninety one degrees earlier. It's definitely warm, uh, unseasonably warm, but uh, definitely summertime in Sioux City. Uh, although it probably will be fine tonight once the sun goes down. A little breeze blowing from left to right here. Other than that, uh, team came out of the weekend after the uh, the scare with uh, Hartman over the weekend. The foul, the uh, line shot back of the box. Everybody uh, was a okay. Uh, the uh, Swope Health Report telling us that uh, the ball club a okay. Everybody all good. And uh, no, uh, nothing to report, nothing to see here, folks. So uh, that's good news as the Monarchs come to Sioux City. Now, uh, Kansas City rolling right along there with another six-game winning streak, and that's good news. But, uh, you know, th- th- this thing still got a lot of baseball to play, something special perhaps brewing, but uh, oh, we keep playing them, keep winning the series, keep do what you got to do. It's not so much the winning streaks, it's the series. And keep doing what you're doing, and the Monarchs have done that. And just about every phase of the ball game. You look at the numbers for Kansas City at this point early on at the quarter pole, past the quarter pole now. Uh, Kansas City first in uh, runs scored, first in average in home runs, on base percentage and OPS average, and first in whip and ERA and strikeouts. So a lot of really good things going on here for this ball club and uh, uh, a lot to be excited about. Uh, Sioux City comes in here 11 and 15. They played much better lately. Uh, they've been on a bit of a trend upwards and uh, should be a really good test. We talked about this on Friday, the three tests for this week going forward. A, Chicago with the best record. How would you fare against them, two uh, first-place teams? B, the long road trip. That thing's still to be determined, and so is the C, which is facing Sioux City, a division bunk made, who you've already seen this year and took two of three from you there in Kansas City. So you'd like to get uh, turn that around because that would keep you uh, – you would have the uh, help around against Sioux Falls – it's Lincoln and Winnipeg already. Only team in the division you don't have an, at Fargo, the upper hand again, at least by game, is Sioux City. They have the upper hand on you by game. So the head-to-head, those head-to-heads seem to come back and uh, matter down the road, and we'll uh, definitely be watching that going forward. Pitching matchup tonight, Lewis Thorpe going. Uh, originally, I told you Tyler Beardsley on Sunday. It'll actually be Kevin McKenna going for the Explorers, who pitched very well there in Kansas City uh, last time we saw them. So, uh, of course, Thorpe has been trending up as well. Lewis, 3-0 and a 3.46. The young man out of Melbourne, Victoria, in Australia, who now lives in Florida. He'll go tonight, the lefty for Kansas City. This is the lineup card behind him for Joe Camp. He had bunch tonight. Willie Abreu will lead off in center field. Darnell Sweeney will bat second. Sweeney at second base. Gabby Guerrero in left field. He'll bat third. Matt Adams, big home run on Sunday. He'll bat in that cleanup spot. The designated hitter, big city time. David Thompson. Thompson batting in the five spot over third base. John Hernandez out in right field. He'll bat six. Casey Gillespie at the first sack. He'll be in that uh, first base spot, batting seventh. Uh, Pete Cosman, short batting eighth. And J.C. Escada will bat ninth. He will catch for Canada City. Willie Abreu, Darnell Swinney, Gabby Guerrero, Matt Adams, David Thompson, John Hernandez. And then it'll be Casey Gillespie, Pete Cosma, and J.C. Escada. Broadcast time beginning in about uh, 15 minutes. We have your top step with Joe Capietri. We'll talk a little bit about the Eric Stout news. Eric Stout, of course, former Monarch, uh, was in the big leagues and is the big leagues now with the Cubs. And I had a chance to see him last night there in Chicago. We'll talk a bit about that with Joe. Also the series uh, with Chicago as well. We don't get a lot of talk about Sioux City, but uh, we will uh, talk about them plenty tonight here in Sioux City. Also your Coors Light flashback moment. Take you back to 1939. Also tell you about Lee Moody. It was a big part of those 1940s Monarchs teams as well. The teammate of Jackie Robinson in 1945 at first base. Talk about him and our Monarchs 101 with DV. We'll also have your American Association numbers brought to you by your Midwest Ford dealers. All that tonight on the pregame on Mix LR, the beginning in about 14 minutes. So we'll have that for you on the radio side. On the audio side, okay, there's no uh, video stream audio for this one. Uh, they do have the capabilities hooked up but it's a TriCaster issue. We'll get to that in the broadcast, but it's not anything that it, this is one of those things that they consult the old DV in the league office 
it's going to be a problem because all you need is anyway, I don't, know, don't get me started. But anyway, okay, be up with you guys in about uh, 14 minutes. Monarchs and the Sioux City Explorers, first of three, and then uh, all night games here from Mercy Field at Lewis and Clark Park. A little hazy sky, but blue above us and 90s to start this thing here in Sioux City. And that's your Monarchs Live pregame show right here from Sioux City. Dan Vaughn with you. Okay, you guys ready for a little go three? I want to go Monarchs. I'm ready. Ready? One, two, three. Go Monarchs. I'll see you in the broadcast. Not everybody. Thank <laughs> you.